Oh yeah, squishcraft time. And hopefully now you can somewhat hear the the looping one song that plays the entire game. I know you're missing out that whole time. Um, <laughs> I, I boosted the music twice the, the, the level it was at. Uh, I guess I have... Oh yeah, I have uh, this. I wonder it's because if I had to like... Because to get to this level I had to wrap around. The idea is that uh, these levels will have to do with like looping. Oh wow, it's it's very zoomed in, but there's actually the same amount. Right, zero is the first one. Ah, uh, oh, okay, yeah. There's a loop here. What is this? Rem this reminds me of Patrick's Parabox. That's kind of cool. Um, I mean, I've seen levels with looping in it before. Um, hmm. If I squish it, it doesn't work. Because it, it cuts off the... Oh. Yeah, that is odd, but how... Can I use that to my advantage? Huh. Wait. Okay, what if I... Uh, what if I uh, squish him? Oh. Well, no. It can't be like that, because then the laser would never hit it. Ooh, man, why is this not easy? <laughs> uh, hmm, no. This is level zero and I'm already confused. I mean, it's gotta be something to do with the loop, but I don't... Is it like something weird about like this? No, that's not really that weird. Huh. Now I have I have them stuck up against each other. So, uh, <laughs> what do I do? I'm like I'm already out of options. Something to do with the looping. Also, is that arrow gonna? move up really fast and like try blocking me what what advantage do I have with this loop I get that the laser can hit itself from the back that's not the idea obviously also now I've got him stuck I, I mean that's all I have is like I can. I could do it. Oh wait. Oh, is it that I want to do it the other way? I think that's it. Ah, okay, clever. All right, so. Ah, it blocked me. Okay. So I have to do it's that, but oh, I see. I think I need to ah. Carefully walk over. <laughs> oh no, I didn't reach it in time. What? Oh, okay. No! <laughs> what? Wait, I can't reach it in time. What? What? Oh wait, I could probably... What if I move it... Ah, okay, okay. So let me let me set this up. So I want to leave it there. Oh shoot! Oh, okay. Wait, hold on. So I no, I go here. So that's weird. I have to put it up there, and then I ah, all right. Uh, wait, but I <laughs> oh, but maybe that's good. Ah, uh, wow. <laughs> Interesting. Cool. I like it. Uh, what? Excuse me? So do I need to cut into that? I think I can do that with... Oh. <laughs> but I don't have room for three. I can't 
What? <laughs> like, I can do that. But. Wait, what? I can't squish three because everything. Every wall has another wall three away from it. I mean. Can I use the arrow? Because. No, because what what does the loop help me with here? How does the loop help me here? Maybe I'm not even understanding the idea of this level. Uh, no, I, I really feel like I need to cut that, but... I can only squish it like that, and then... But I need to squish three, but if I do that, I can't squish now. How to squish? What? I literally just need to cut that open. <laughs> it's so weird how like how simple these levels can be, but how difficult it is to come up with what you need to do. Is this like another mechanic I don't know or something? Or am I just being silly? Because like that doesn't help. I need to get that open, but to get it open, I need to do a triple squish, but to do a triple squish, I need to have room between the walls. And I don't see how the looping helps me get more room. Because, like, yeah, I can, you know, do this or whatever. But that doesn't squish. Um, I, I don't even have any good ideas for this one. Like, there's no... I, I feel like I need to cut that open. I, that's the only way I could possibly do that, but... It, so it seems like it wants me to do a triple squish because of the way these walls are oriented, but I don't have enough room anywhere except here, but... But, I don't, I, but then if I... Yeah, I, no, it doesn't work, because it, it would only work if I could also activate that up arrow, but... Oh, wait, actually, maybe it does work. If I, like, keep this on the very top or something. Well... See, I could push something out then. So may maybe there is something to that, actually. But what, like... There, I mean, I have the cut I want, but now I want the laser. And because I cut it right there, I don't have the laser. I don't know, it's, I think it might have something to do with this, though. Let me see, let me just try a couple combinations to see if anything comes to me. Uh, maybe like this? Well, that just, no, that's just bad. I do... This. Ah! Ah! Oh, that's so clever. The laser's coming at one side and the... 
targets on the back. Wow, that's a really clever idea for a level. Oh, and we're looping around to get to the other one. What in the world? What? I don't e <laughs> I'm at the right what what okay I don't know I don't know any of this okay okay so that's just a giant that's not a giant cat block but just a, a cat block split up into pieces these I I have two versions of the of me that I'm moving at the same time and these walls kill me if I move into them okay that's a lot at once but okay uh, why is this so insane? Also, what is that eye doing? Is it like activate those spike walls or something? So I need to kill that spike. Oh, I see. And then I can destroy it like that. So maybe I need to... Oh, I'm... Wait. That pushes through. Oh, so that that stuff can go through those walls. Okay. So I'm guessing I need to keep both of my guys alive, but maybe not. Um. Okay, I don't think I could ever turn off the eye then. But I need to kill the spike, but. Yeah, so it's like, I could start pushing things through. Except that kills that. But it, it almost seems like that's what I would want to do. But these sides loop. So I don't have anything solid to squish against unless I could s So that's why it feels like I would need to get these like all vertically aligned. But then I still have... No, but then I can't squish up against that. What? How am I supposed to do this? Um, I mean, I can move the spike away. Maybe that's the idea. I just need to... Okay, I moved the spike out of the way. Ah, uh, no. Okay, I need both of them alive. Okay, so I need to move both of the spikes away. Okay, so I can't move left. I can't move down. I can't move right. So I have to start by moving up. At least I know that. But now I have options. Um... I can kind of get this spike away safe. Oh, no, I can't. Oh, right, no, I can't. Maybe if I do this, move that up. Move two over. Do all this. Then I can... Oh, I can almost move it away safely. I would still need another one, though. Well, I can do that. And now I have my spike away safely on the right side, but... I need to like get these I need to like yeah cuz I could free the okay hmm. so I'm just wondering can no I oh yeah no I can do this so if I could get a block to the left of them right now and then both move down that'd be good but I can also push that one vertically okay so but see, I can't get to the behind this block without killing that guy, so it seems like I need to instead um, find a way to like push that over. Okay, that's not good. But I don't want to move there. Huh.
Yeah, it's like if I could... Ah, oh, I need to move a lot, though, over there to do that. Like, I would really need to get a line of things going. Okay, actually, that's somewhat good. Oh, wait, no, I don't want to... Because if I have that there, that's kind of good, but it'll die. It's, like, I, I would want th that to be, like, the last one I push. Hmm. How do I get these blocks that I push up at the start without pushing that? To oh, no, I can push that to the right, because I'll probably push it back later. So let me push those over. Oh, well that one, that one up against the wall is very good, so, maybe I do that, right, oh, I need the fragile one, huh, but even then, it's like, it's not quite enough, I really need all all of them along that line, so even that one that I moved down. It's like that can work. That's fine. That's fine, but I can't. get around the other side of this without like pushing something in hmm. yeah so like I did that but I still need but even if I had one more and I pushed it wouldn't that no I guess that would no that wouldn't be enough because I can't move down. Like, I c if I push it down, it's not useful. Oh, so maybe I need to push it one up above. Yeah, I think that's what I need. So, oh, but I can't push that cat block. Uh, so... I can push it one down. But is there a reason why I'd want to do that? Maybe? Because then I could start... Uh, I could s well, I could only do this if... There was a way to avoid that guy running straight into the spike. I don't know, like it, do I want to push that one to the right for some reason? Even if I could get all of these in a line. One, two, three, so one, two, three, one, so one, two, three, four, and then I could push once. That doesn't seem great. Do I need to, like, get that spike out of the way first for this guy so that more stuff can happen? All, the spike is almost out of the way, but maybe now I can... Okay, it's out of the way for this guy. Oh, wait. Now what? Um, uh. <laughs> I mean, like, no, I can't do that. Uh, that one's stuck there. Like, do I want to use the spike 
fox in some way. I feel like maybe I have to use the spike fox in some way. Uh, I just don't know what to do. Do it. Maybe I need to push things from the other... Yeah, maybe that. Like, maybe I need to push it from this side, loop around. Um, what would that be like? Uh, that would be like... One, two, three, four. And then I push... Maybe, but... It's like, that block is just doing me no good. <laughs> mm. But see, I can't push anything that way because without killing that guy so that can't quite be it but I could push things like there yeah I could and then I could even push one no I can't push one more there's a wall there um one two three four uh maybe that's it so let's see how would that happen Okay, that was bad. Huh? <laughs> um, I would need to get one, two, three, four things over though. <coughs> Excuse me, I couldn't couldn't mute in time. My bad. Uh. All right, so. Some way I can. No, not that. Um... Ah. Let's see if I push that there, though. Oh, and I destroy that. Ah, it's so hard. Like, I, I just want to... <laughs> I want to move around freely, but... I'll kill one of them. Mm. Yeah, like, it's easy enough to get one of them to the goal, but it's really hard to get both. I'm out of options now. Yeah, so even, like, I can't get one more of them in that line because I had to move the spike. Or did I have to move the spike? I did move the spike anyways. I guess I didn't have to. But if I do this, that one dies. So that's not very good. So is there some way I can get around that, maybe? Hmm. It's like, this one's just like, it's like too high up. That actually gets that there. Okay, I managed to do that. But I don't actually think that added anything because... 
you know, like, I... I can't get the block still. Because I'm very limited on... I can push it down like that. But that's it. Which, and that doesn't seem very useful. Yeah, so I don't see how... And I don't see how I can squish anything. And this sort of thing isn't actually useful for many reasons. <laughs> That's why it seems like I want to like push stuff through the other side actually, but how would I do that? So set it up in the other way sort of, can I get that going? I mean everything is set up in a way that maybe that can happen, but the problem is like I would need to... I think one thing would have to go against that wall. Maybe that's okay. Is that if you, can I, can I do that? Hmm. Uh, it, it's so hard to like get. I don't know if that's possible. Uh. <laughs> um, no, not that. Like, I keep just doing that. I don't know. I don't even know what I'm doing anymore. Ah! I don't know. I'm going to try a different level. Or, no, I don't have another level to try. Oh, That's rough. Um, I guess I can go around this side to get to two. Oh, wait. I was doing three that whole time. Maybe that's why it was so crazy. Well, no, this is kind of just a totally different thing. Uh, Alright, so I need that laser to hit all of them, sort of? Or I guess it could hit them one at a time. But I can't move that laser. Uh, okay, so maybe I can get these squished if I, like, set this up right. Uh... uh yeah, because if I, like, get in front of it, maybe I can... So I need to, like, set this up. <laughs> this is weird. Uh, yeah, I squished one on accident, but that's actually fine. So there, I squished them. I feel like I want to squish them all together, but... Yeah, because the laser's only hitting two. I think I can get them squished all together. I think I just kind of messed that up on accident. <laughs> Is that what I want? Oh wait, don't push it that way. Oh, that only hits the middle one though. And I don't think it would be useful to actually like push that gray one up here at least for the uh cuz i mean all it would do is like be able to push once and by that time i wouldn't be able to get over here so that, like that doesn't seem right is there a certain way i can squish these that would be better I don't know, that's funny, because it's like... Oh wait, maybe I want to do that. And then, like, switch sides. And then set it up again. Oops. 
Ah. I don't, I don't even know why this would work. I just feel like there's something about that. <laughs> Actually, I don't think so. Uh. Yeah, so how would I get... I mean... Hmm, how would I do that? Like, the arrow is a squishable block. So I feel like I have to consider that. I pr and like, I, it's just, it's not doing anything at the end. Like, cause I could do, well for one I could do that, but for two, I can squish that. And that can be moving now, but again, it's like, it's not really useful. Cause I wouldn't be able to get over there. I can't squish those or anything. Oh wait. No, because... Even if I... Did something like that, yeah, no. Well, I mean... No, I can't, and yeah, once the green is like, being moved, like... Because I was thinking, if I move the green and then bring it up or something. No, because they would just get in the way of all the other ones. So what do I need to do here? Is it possible to get it so they all three of them... I don't think it's possible. And I can't get squished because there's not enough room anywhere for that. I don't think there's any room. I could do, you know, vertical squishes and split them. Let me just see, like, is there... Okay, yeah, because if I do, like... I would have to do three, which is actually kind of hard, because... Oh, no, I just have to, like, line it up, I guess, or... Yeah, I guess I would just have to line it up. Huh, but then that's just, all that is doing is giving me something with like different bottom tops, but uh, if anything I'd want them sideways, but the only way to do that is the other way. Hmm. No, that doesn't seem useful. So... If I do this, oh wow, that squishes them instantly into one, I didn't even realize, that's funny. I guess, is there no way to get around that, because that one's, yeah, because I can't just, like, stay still. There's no, there, yeah, if there was a button that let me, st well, no, it would just push me, probably. But if I move right, that one moves left, and we squish them into one. But that doesn't work because it would only hit the green because that laser's like a third of the size. If we do two, we can hit two of them, but I would need to get the red one in. Hmm. I mean, do I like start with this and then I have to like... I mean, see, because, like, that's... Oh, wait, is that it? Ha! <laughs> no! Wait! <laughs> wait, I thought I had it, and then I realized I didn't. Uh... Alright, because I can't have the... Shoot, I can't have them stop. Alright, dang, that was almost good. Hmm... Yeah, I can't have the laser stop. I could... But it's funny that I can combine them like that. Uh, but, oh, maybe if I could still have one of them, because, like, if I attach them, that, that means that, uh, 
As long as one or blue or green are, are on, it should work. So maybe that's the trick. The only problem is like that, once I put a block up there, I can't get it back out. So I need to have it already set up. Um... Okay, wait, one thing I want to try, just because I just thought of it. Like, if I... Okay, well, whatever. That works. If I bring this one up so and put it in there, and then bring these in to squish... Yeah, all that does is, like, that. Hmm. No. I mean, because I, I can't squish more than three of them, and then I can't do anything with that. But I was thinking, like, eh, no, okay. If I had two... No, it just switches from one to the other because of the way that works. If I had... Wait, yeah, if I do this, I can get that... But I would, st I, there would still be an issue that I need to get that blue and the red. Yeah, no, that's not good quite, but. Oh, I don't know. I feel like there could be something to that. It's funny that, like, the green would keep moving in one way, and then I could, like, use it to squish something again. But I don't think I could, like, free anything from there. Like, it, if only I could, um, be here and then have the something get pushed into the laser, and then I could push the red down or something then maybe there'd be something going on. But I can't be here with that something in a laser being activated while I'm in there, so... I can get the green out by pushing the red up here. But then, once the red is up here, there's nothing... That can't be fixed, I don't think, so that's not good. Hmm. This is like a simple looking level, but there's a lot of things you can try to do. think of what, how I'd want to, like, uh, okay, that is not useful, is it? No, because I did that on accident. But <laughs> I can do that, but then, yeah, so that is almost good, but the problem is, once I get the red move, the blue and green go back. I can't have all three of them because... Yeah, I mean, uh... Even if I put the gray... Oh, I don't want the red like that. Let me just... Even if I put the gray one...
up here like that and then do this. When I push the red one in, it'll just activate the red, so... It almost feels like I want, like, a... Uh... Huh. It almost feels like the two I squished together for the laser should be different than the two I squished together here and then maybe that would be interesting but that just doesn't, that can't work because that's like literally hmm. man I really thought I had it when I did this but the fact that it switches back I don't think I can do anything about that it almost seems like I want to bring one of those sliding ones up here free to do something with, but I just, I can't even get one, honestly. There's just not enough room, I don't think. Wait, hold on, I just want to see something. Okay, wait, this is kind of interesting. If I, if I was to put, squish the gray one into that and then move it, ah, and then it stays. That might be it. All right, hold on. So green and red, green and red. Let's do this. <laughs> wait, so, ba 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 ba. Green and red, all right, so. Yeah, so I can put that there. No, because I need green and red. Okay, wait. <laughs> let me just not... Okay, let me just be more neat about this. So that... Okay, green and red. Squish you together. And then... I, first, I want blue and then I want to squish the gray into the blue Oops. and then I want to put you there yeah okay that's a cool level that was really interesting also I kind of needed to beat it or I'd be really stuck because three is hard <laughs> alright let's try double two or squish two what is that middle one what does that plus symbol mean on it? I don't know what that means. And why is... The red block is just there for funsies, I guess. See, I don't know what all these symbols mean. <laughs> oh, I can't squish it, it looks like, because you'd think that would be squishable. Also, like, why isn't... I'm confused why, like, nothing is squishing, honestly. Ah, uh, yeah, you normally think it would squish. Can I squish it vertically? No, why c So that's not the normal, like, no squish symbol, though. I th because I thought that normally it's just, like... <laughs> God, it's, like, hard to... What if I attach these grays into each other? Ha, <laughs> no, they don't want to move at all. What am I even trying to do here, though? I, I don't understand what that plus is. I don't know, like, I've never encountered it before. Seems like I can't squish it with anything. But then wh why would I even want it? <laughs> plus, I don't know what plus means. Maybe I'll leave this, because I, I just, I don't even know what to do. I mean, I could, I can squish the grays into the spikes, but it's like, yeah, I'm not exactly sure why I'd want to do that. Okay. 
because then it just kind of gets stuck. And I can't do anything with the plus. Yeah, I feel I feel like I need to understand what the deal with the plus is if I want to beat this one. I mean, maybe if I do... Okay, I just want to see what happens if I do, like, a triple squish. Alright, I need to, like... Ah. There. If I, if I could... Well, actually, a triple squish is kind of hard. <laughs> oh, wait, no, I can do it. Okay. But hmm. Uh, yeah, I feel like I need to understand that plus if I want to do something here. Cause I don't actually know what that accomplished. Like I can, I could squish the, the, the left pointing arrow into the uh, spike. Okay, let me just get in line with it. Oh, I screwed it up. Okay, now I think I should be. <laughs> Why? Why can't I get in line with you? All right, there we go. Hmm, yeah, but it doesn't like... Oh my god, that was, <laughs> that was like violent. Crush. All right. uh, hmm. Yeah, I thought maybe it's like, because that one's a full gray and that one's a half, it would have like more pushing force or something, but it doesn't seem like it. Okay, I don't know. Yeah, I'll, uh, I'll come back to that at some point. Ooh, what the? That's a tiny little square there. Okay, I can do that. I can also push this through. Okay. Wait, what? So I need to move the red and the blue. Yeah, because I can't access that. Okay. But they're in that block, and I... I can't even... Wait, what am I supposed to do? Is that block pushable? No, it's not even pushable. So I would need to have the eye. Okay. Yeah, so it's like, hmm. See, like, it needs to be like that, but higher. Wait, how is that accomplished? Maybe I need to do the thing where I have the, uh, yeah, like what I have it, how it looks right now, but squished with the eye in that, which is like, I guess like this. No wait. Oh, I think I did it the wrong way. So, uh, like. Like this for some reason, but if I squish it there, I actually it's kind of stuck, which isn't great. Um, don't want to push that because. Okay. Uh. I mean, I can probably set up a triple squish. Seems like I would want to get them out here. Mm -hmm. I can squish two of them and then still use them. Okay, I mean, so if I wanted to, I can get stuff out here. Uh, and I'm still able to get them free because I can do like that and stuff. So there's there's room. It's kind of weird, but there is room. Uh, okay, I can accomplish that. I don't know, is that good for some reason? Some reason why I'd want to attach those into each other. 
Doesn't seem like it got it was very useful like that. Maybe I would push you there. Uh and then push you. Okay, I can get the blue free, but the blue being free isn't useful on its own. I would need to get both of them free. That's a very particular angle that I can't even get on the other side. The blue is free, but I need both. I really do need both at the same time. Hmm. I mean, the eye can loop like that, but it's not useful unless I can... Hmm. I don't have, like, a plan right now, which sucks. Oh, that's kind of good, actually, I just realized. That, that, that was good. Okay, so if I can push the eye like that, but then I need it to somehow do that on both sides. Hmm, I just had a thought. If I keep that pyramid looking design which, uh, it's kind of weird to set up. How did I do it so easily before? I think I must have set it up a different way. Um, but if I get, uh, if I get this, and then I squish it from above with the eye, Oh, no, then it's at that angle. Okay, because that's... Wait, but if... Uh, no, if I did it the other way around, it still wouldn't be good. Shoot. Yeah, I thought maybe that would be good, though, because it's like now it's pointing left and right. But it's not the right height. But it is pointing left and right, but... Mm, Wait, yeah, no, if I did it the other way around, so... So, uh... Like... This... But then pushed it over... Aha! <laughs> okay, cool. Nice, I didn't give up on that track, I'm glad. I am like... Oh no, okay, I can go to six. But to get to... How do I even get to 9? Oh, I guess I need to... Or, wait, no, this is... I don't know. I'm just going to try 6. <laughs> wait, what? I am a block... <laughs> what? Wait, what? Which one am I? I'm all, I'm all of them. Yeah, I'm all of them. Okay. But I can't push anything because I'm every bit of me is breakable so how how would I how would I beat this level I mean I could set up a squish oops I wanted to do that yeah oh that one that one moves a lot faster so maybe that's the trick, is like, if I move... Oh, if I move fast enough, maybe I can just jump straight to the goal? Okay, that is weird. So maybe, uh... Ah, <laughs> I was hoping that would work. Can I, like, swap there? Whoa. Okay, that's no good. 
Ah. Kind of dangerous. Mm -hmm. Okay. That is weird, though, that they move, like, twice as fast. I guess it makes some sense. It's catching up. So it's like, ah, uh, I need something that... Does that move far enough? I think that almost does. Because, let's see, it... This piece moves from here, and then I press to here. Oh, wait, no, let me undo that. Here. Now, that's only moving two. So that's not quite good enough. But it, it kind of seems like I might have been able to move those spikes. How do I... How am I going to, like... I feel like he's, like, misaligned, though. How would I, I guess I could correct it like that or something. Oops. Hmm. Because I, I can move one spike, one down. Hmm. Okay, th there's, it's something like that, but... I don't quite... Do I want to make, like, two that go twice as fast? Is that possible? So... So that one... That one... Oh, wait, I see. Because of the way... No, no, they all have... Huh. You'd think that one would be going twice as fast, because it has, like, two attached to it, but it still moves at the same speed. But... This, that moves twice as fast for some reason. Is it just like something to do with the order of them? Like what if I squish that? That moves twice as fast. I don't understand what makes it move twice as fast. Okay, now they're both moving twice as fast. Oh, it's still not fast enough? Or no, not, I guess they're both... Yeah, they're both moving twice as fast, right? <laughs> but they're not pushing into each other or something? Uh, this is a weird level. Um, not sure I really understand the mechanics of when they move twice as fast. What if I, you know, like, what if I do, like, a triple squish? No, I can't do a triple vertical swish, squish. No, yeah, I, I probably can. I just need to be really careful how I line it up. Or can I? Yeah, because it's kind of, like, tricky because... Oh, no, yeah, I guess I could. So that was, like, triple there. That one's moving double speed. Now they're both moving double speed, but it's not fast enough. Move those. And I can't squish anymore, because that's not a squishable thing. I can only do like one triple squish then and I did it when I when I did this. That was a triple squish. Do that. That moves really fast. Maybe that's what I want. Oh. Okay. <laughs> sure. <laughs> Interesting. I I kind of understood, but I kinda didn't. Let me do seven next. Okay, I'm plus. What does that mean? What does plus mean? I don't understand. I haven't, like, gotten a good example of that yet. Oh, okay. Oh, man. Alright. So, ooh. Red is the only one that doesn't have an arrow for it. 
Uh, when I turn off red, or when I turn on red, ah, uh, yeah, I need them all open, but I need to be through. I think, I think plus just means I'm unsquishable, but there's things with black borders that are all, maybe black borders means unpushable and unsquishable. Hmm. I mean, that green, once it moves that way, that's bad. So I don't think I want that. Hmm. Hmm. This is very weird. I mean, I can't even, like, get that free now, actually. That's kind of annoying. Once it's against the left wall, it's stuck. Alright, so I just want to see. If I squish together red and blue, let's say... How would I do this? <laughs> be, like, so careful. Oh, actually, I did something different. That might be good for some reason. Oh, no, okay. Let's just squish together red and blue. Like this. down. Okay, so now I've activated both... Oh, wait. <laughs> okay, obviously I didn't want that to happen. Squish together both red and blue, but... Uh... Hmm. They move, like, instantly. I could get, the, like, the laser attached to me, but... I don't have a loop over here. I only have going through one side. Hmm. I don't have anything that can move up or, or down, only left and right, so... I mean, is there, like, some sort of system I could set up that would, like, alternate on and off or something? I feel like that's what I need to do. That's kind of crazy, though. Like, if I had, like, when it turns to one thing, that makes one of those arrows move. But because that arrow moves, it blocks the laser. But because it blocks the laser something I see something else and then it like it repeats back and forth I think I could with green and blue do that green and blue arrows actually like that because then that makes it go that way but I can at least yeah change it back oh I just squished that but the thing is once I put anything on that wall I have to keep it there so I have to be really careful I don't want to see. I mean, I think I know what happens when I do this, but yeah, it just doesn't. Uh, how could I get that to work where it... When it's blocked... It would have to be, like, blocked... Oh, wait, maybe I want the... Okay, so maybe I want... Green attached to the blue arrow and blue attached to the green arrow. Maybe that's the trick. Because maybe just somehow that's kind of the, the weirdness of it is that you want alternate stuff. But then I would need it to be like... 
Hold on. So, when... <laughs> okay, let me not do that. Do I need to, like, now attach these two together or something? I can't do it like that. Oh, if I block it, I could. No, because that would just stay in place. That's not what I want. What do I need? I need it to be that... <sighs> when green blocks it... Wait, actually, yeah, if I had green attached to green, that actually does just... So let me set that up. If I have green attached to green, carefully move stuff. Did I just screw it up? If I have green attached to green... Ah, oh, man, it's so annoying. Alright, green attached to green makes it so that when I push it in, <laughs> it pushes itself back off. And then... And then I would want it to be like, if it pushes itself off... That I mm, mm. don't want to split the eye. Could I split the eye? I would have to split it horizontally. Yeah, I'd have to split it horizontally. I don't think I have the room to really do that. Maybe. I kind of could. So it's like I kind of could do. Oh wait, no, the eye would have to be in the middle, but I kind of could set that up if I really wanted to. Just for example. So I could split the laser. And I could even have it so like one laser is there, and the other laser is... Oh, you know, and maybe that's good, is like... When the laser's there, it moves that way. And then it sees the blue, so it points the other way. So I'd want the laser to have both... Green and blue on it. Green and blue arrows on it. Okay, let's try that. <laughs> if I can figure out how that would work. Um, uh, I guess it doesn't matter where the arrows are on it, so that's good at least. Ah, oh, jeez. Um, <laughs> it's kind of crowded in here. Uh. What the heck? How, how do I... Why is this hard? Okay, I mean, like, with the idea I have, I think I would just, in the end, want green and blue to be, like, down there anyways. So maybe... Huh. Oh, wait, no, does this work? Because then I can... Yeah. Alright, so... Like that. Oh wait, no, and then it would have to be like... Ah, see, now it's alternating. Which is cool. And I can slip by. But then I need the red to also... get activated sometimes. 
So that's why it seems like I would want to... Oh yeah, so it's like maybe I want the eye in the middle so that I can do that. Okay. So, and I would want... I think I would want to combine it with the green. But I want the eye in the middle. Okay, I think I can pull that off. So eye in the middle and red and green. Alright, eye in the middle. Kind of tricky. Uh, okay, wait, I guess I could put this here. Sort of. Can I? Uh, but then the red is... Something's gonna get stuck. Could do that. Huh. <laughs> it's still hard just to get everything out of the way. How do I get in there safely? Like, maybe at first I just want to move this green more. Oh, but once I put something against the wall, uh, I can put the red or the green against the wall, though. Or the blue, even, I guess. I guess it's not really a big deal. Okay, um, why is this still difficult? Alright, hold on. <laughs> Maybe I should just combine the red and the green, like, straight off the bat. Get that out of the way. <laughs> because that's easy to do. No, oh my god. Okay, so... <laughs> there, okay. Combined. Alright, that's out of the way. I wanted that. But now I want... Okay, I think this is it. Uh, wait, okay, but I need that. No, I need the eye to not be against the floor. Which... I've screwed up, so I don't want the eye against that floor. Can't ever have that eye against the floor, actually, so that was just bad to do that. It can be there, though. And then I can... Maybe... So I also... Yeah, that could go there. Okay, and then... Green and red. Oh wait, no, I don't want blue. I can't have all three of them there, so no, I can't, I don't want that. Okay, this could be okay. And then... Let's just attach green and red. And then do that. And then that, and then that. Then the green needs... Okay, and then this. Yeah! Alright, that is what I wanted. Yes! Wow, that was crazy. You need to build like a circuit. That was wild. Alright, let's do... I have... What do I... I don't have access to 9. Oh, why did I think I had access to 9? I have access to 8, though. Or 5. Did I try 5? No, I didn't. Alright, let's try five. Okay, we have a bunch of looping space. That eye just activates that. I'm breakable. 
I have this cat. Why would I... I don't understand what I'm supposed to be doing here. Those spikes seem like not movable, but I have to get in there, and if I want to get in there, I need to be protected on like all sides, but that that's not gonna happen. Why would the laser be useful here? Oh, is this the thing where I need to like split myself and make myself move at double speed so that I can move like two steps over and then two steps up? I feel like that's got to be it. So if I want to split myself, I guess I would need... That's not right. I would need like a third thing. I don't know. Let's just try... Oh, wait. No. Okay. So I see, but I need... Huh. That's weird, because, like, if I want a third thing, it's kind of tricky. Because... Maybe I push from this side. Oh, but I just squished those two together. I wanted to be squished. So, no, I need it against the wall, but... Oh, but I don't have a wall to be squished against unless I push it up. Yeah, so it's like, I would need to push that... See, like, I'm not going to be pushed against anything unless I bring it up here or something. Okay, in which case, I probably shouldn't even have the laser activated if I want to set that up. Okay, actually, I need to bring it over a bit. So I could get squished against the wall... Oh, wait... Uh, no, yeah, I can do this. Wait, what am I doing? But I would need to... I would need that to be activated right when I move in. I could push something down. How would I act? Uh, Cause is that all? No, cause I need I need to be triple squished so I can split myself in half and then combine with myself or something, right? That's how it works. I'm still not really sure how it works, to be honest. Um, maybe you know before. It, before I continue that, I just want to go with back to that level that used that mechanic. Yeah, I just want to understand. So, so let's just look. So, actually, let's do like the simplest. So this is me squishing another me, and it does move twice as fast. I did one where like it didn't move twice as fast though. Oh, see that was like. See, why is that not move twice as fast? Oh no, that does. No, it doesn't. Never mind. Why does that not move twice as fast? Is it because it's like they're still attached to make the same picture? So it's like not really. They need to be like a different. They can't be attached to make the same picture maybe. So I just want to see like if I swap them. Is that doable? Or, I mean, it doesn't even matter. It could just be any different combination of them. Uh. Well, yeah, I mean, that worked. But I, w I wanted to see if, like, the... It was, like, the triple squish that was messing it up, or if it was something else. Okay, wait. Ah, uh, no, not like that. It's actually really hard to set it up another triple squish. 
But I, th I think it has to do with, like, the picture has to be, like, different. Like, it can't be matched up the same way as it was. I think that's it. Okay. Well, now I, I, now I kind of understand that. Uh, am I on eight? No. Oh, wait, no, I was doing five. God, there's so many weird ways to get to these levels. So I would need to cut the picture in half and then put it back together in a different way. But I only have five blocks. To, to cut myself in half, I would need to squish... I need to do a triple squish. Which would bring me... Yeah, no, I think that could be doable. Okay, so... How do I get triple squish? I would need to be in the middle, first of all. The arrow would need to... Let me get the cat as well. The arrow... The arrow would need to be on one side and then like the cat like there. Oh, I... Wait, let me free the arrow just so it's a bit easier to move. And then now I need it activated. How could I do that? Could the eye be part of this? I think it could because... Yeah, I think the eye could be part of this, so... Like, would it somehow be beneficial... Maybe have this one free and then this there and then somehow make it so that right when I step into the right when I step into here it would activate the arrow how would I do that because it's like I would either have to push something up or down but that's not into the laser The laser goes up and down, so it's like I would have to push it left or right. If I do that, that's, that's almost it. That's kind of interesting, but... But it would need to, like... So if I did that, but if the if the laser block was here and I moved, uh, yeah, if I had the laser block there now, but how would I accomplish that? So I need to be here against the wall, but with something on either side of me. Oh wait, maybe if I distance that one, because then I could give myself a moment to set it up. Uh, let me just do that, just so I can have it on that side. Wait, oh yeah, there we go. Okay, cool. So now... I just need to squish around in that direction somehow. Oh, but I can't squish myself. So I need something to squish us. So I'm going to have to use this again, it looks like. Well, hopefully I can do it, because I didn't really think about that ahead of time. <laughs> so weird. Uh, yeah, 
Yeah, because now I need... Now I need to, like, involve... Oh. Wait. Er... Oh, oh, can I just have it... The arrow just activated and helping me? Does that work? How would I have the arrow activated, though? Like, could I... Uh, I can't do any vertical squish. Yeah, so how would I have the arrow activated and helping me? Because for a moment there, I, like, was moving... But I would need it constantly activated. So, like, that was good for a moment. Yeah, for that one step, I'm moving double. Oh, wait, so that guy, ah, uh, oh, wait, is that it? If I could just have them, yeah, yeah, okay, so I think I have it, so I just need that, so I need the laser stuck there, how is this going to work, uh, yeah, okay, I need the laser stuck against that wall and that, like that. Oh, I was protected. Okay, I didn't even think of that through. I was protected on... Wow, okay, that worked out better than I thought. <laughs> nice. Okay, I have access to three from this side, but I still... Three seems really hard, actually. All right, I beat this section, but let's look at eight and nine before I wrap this session up. Let's at least look at them. What the heck? But that seems like it kills me no matter what. Is there a way that I can, um... Oh. Oh, yeah, there. I mean, like... I don't fully understand the timing of that, but... Because it looks like when I move into the green, it'll have its spikes out. So it, it seems like backwards to what I'd expect, but okay. But it's so weird because, like, I don't even have any options here other than to... Okay, well, that allows me to get in there. And I can get back out. And now... I need the orange to be moved on and on. On and off. Or just off completely. That turns it off. And now the purple... Oh no, okay, because that laser over there is still working. So, I need to find a way to knock it off, which maybe I could do. What, where was that? Oh, the blue is there originally. I was hoping I could push the laser through that side. Uh... But that wouldn't even work, because the blue is, like, fragile. Okay, but the blue... That's funny that they gave me... That... Oh, wait, how did I... So I can get here now. Oh, wait. Ah, but it's... The timing is off. And I can't fix that while I'm in here because I'm perfectly lined up with that I need to be like so I need to like do something to offset myself but any movement I do it's like I can't offset myself I'm, I'm stuck being on the wrong tempo. So how do I make it so... Oops. Oh wait, oh, okay, I'm on the wrong tempo for that. But if I go through the loop, I'm fixed. Guess I could... Oh no, I can't bring that through because it would always be off tempo when I'm trying to push it through. 
things. I can bring this laser through, but what good does that do me exactly? Oh, the laser can't be destroyed, but it's not like that's actually useful. And turning back on the blues wouldn't be useful. I don't understand, like what I get I get that I get that by going through here, now I can make it through this. But now what? I mean the blue it just seems like obviously I don't want that on. I can't push that through ever. I can get the laser out so that the blue isn't activated so that now I can get through here, but I can't get through here because I'm on the wrong tempo, but I had to be on the right tempo to get through. But what else can I do at this point? Because... Must be something else I can do. What else could I do? That thing pushing the buttons, I can't quite get anything, like, I can almost push something there, but not quite. But even then, it wouldn't really be useful, because, right, like that. Uh -huh. I can push something there safely, is that something? It'd only be something if I could maybe get that fragile blue through, but I don't see how I could. I don't think that accomplishes anything. Oh, this level's so simple, but I just don't see what to do. I get that I can go through if I do this, but I don't get how to fix my tempo while I'm in here. I don't actually see a way. It's like that blue has nothing to do with anything, it's just getting me through here. But the blue is like forever just locked in there now because it's always gonna, I guess because it's like, I actually don't fully understand why it can't, oh no, because that's, yeah, that's one off. If I could somehow push it with like, you know, the laser as like a buffer or something, that would work, but I can't, I don't have enough room to do that. Because like, I would need the laser above and then I push it and then and then that would kind of work but I don't Wait, what if I use the laser to push it off to offset it? Okay, actually, okay, that's an idea. Okay. <laughs> so what I'm thinking is I go here. Uh but the problem is like so I'm thinking this but then the problem is that, like, maybe it is offset, but I can't get it out. Because <laughs> it was, like, against that wall at the start, and I can't fix that. I can get the laser free, but I can't get the blue out of there. Because it's against that orange wall. And my only option is to push it down, but because the tempo is off, it'll always die when I push it down. Unless there's some way for me to switch the tempo of that purple-green thing, which I thought maybe I could do like this, but... Oh wait, that kills me now. Oh, so I did switch the tempo? Wait, how did I do that? Oh, I just understood. Okay, 
So I used a step to just not move at all. It's like I used like a time step because I was I tried to push the eye block down, but it's being blocked by the purple green. So now I'm off tempo, and now I can go in the goal. Interesting. That was a clever level. All right, let's try nine. So I can't be squished, and that one cat block can't. And I just need to activate that. So we're good. No, okay, but it gets pushed right back. So I need to. Hmm. What do I need? So I need like. Do I need a way for? Hmm. No, nah, that's not it. What do I need? It's like I would. Hmm. The only way to activate the laser block is by pushing the laser in there. But when I push the laser in there, it pushes off and then it's stuck. So, hmm. That thing moves down. I have a bunch of cat blocks that I can combine with stuff, but if I do stuff like that... Okay, well now I've split the laser. But I still... I still don't have... Cause I really need to get the laser stuck on that. If I had the down block there, no, I would. Is there like something I can force it to like not move to the? Oh, you know that's interesting. If I if I hold left, that thing moves down two way over there. So maybe maybe I just need to get this. Oh wait, like there, and then get a whole bunch of cat blocks so that I can like push, 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 and then like go up. Or wait, I guess it would be like up, up, and then push to block it, so that next time I activate it. Okay, so is that possible? It's kind of hard to get these cat block. Oh no, I I do have. Uh, <laughs> wait, no, it is hard, sort of, but I think, oh, no, don't squish them. So, like, ah, it squished it. I thought it would make it, but it didn't. So, hmm, it didn't make it. Oh wait, but I could use the extra block to help me push that. So maybe this will work. I uh, just need to set it up like that, and boom. So wait, this is kind of tricky because I need to like hold it there. Ah, uh, but I want to hold it there is the thing. Oh, wait, no, that that's working, because I can't push it left, because, oh, yeah, okay. So then this, this. No, but it doesn't... It doesn't get held because... Or, no, wait, the last action is up? Oh, no, because, oh, that one... Mm.
the last uh no it wants to move up when it's off the laser but that wants to move only moves down when it's on the laser oh wait but could i wedge stuff in into this spot so that it like holds now maybe so how would that work i would need to like push that see the tricky thing is i want to like wedge that there but it moves away as soon as I let go. That kind of has to happen. I think. Hmm. I don't think I can wedge it in there. It'd be nice if I could, because then I could just go free. I don't think there's any point in splitting the laser like that in the end. So I don't know why I'm just rolling with whatever, but yeah, I don't why no I mean no I would use the down air okay I think I wanted to use the down oh wait hold on let me just reverse because like that was kind of weird that I even got that in the first place so so if I use the down arrow to help me wedge it in place maybe Because then it's almost working. The thing is, like, I need... I need to, like... Oh, wait. Yeah, uh, no, it's like, I would want, like, a train of pieces. But I can't really quite... Oh, no, that kind of works. Wait. Oh, no, but I want the down arrow to be in the same line as me but then I want hold on so <laughs> no so I, I need to ah so I think I need the down arrow there sort of I don't, I don't, I don't want to squish that necessarily but and then okay wait so I think I kind of screwed that up. So let's do like this. And then if I need to wedge, how do I wedge? How do I, how do I keep saying wedge where I am? It would have to be the down arrow, right? Yeah, so then I just need the down arrow there. But then I don't have something on my right side. Mm. Oh wait, but if I make a train, it could work. No, I still didn't have anything on my right side. So I was thinking it'd be like this, and then... No, I think I... So that, did I want the train on the other side? Maybe I wanted the train on the other side. The cat train. And then this. Oh, but the problem is that I have to go in there. Right. Yeah, so the cat train isn't really helping. I don't, I don't see how I can get thing wedged. Cause it's like I need to leave and have something replace me. 
Which is like, I would have to, wait, no, when I just, I would just have to be in that position that I was in. Oh, but see, to get in that position I was in, I need to push that left. And to push that left, I have that opening on the side of me. So if only I could get in that position. I mean, what if I let the down arrow do that, and then... Is there some way to stop the down arrow now? No, I don't think I can stop the down. But Oh, but I could probably split the down arrow into two. Oh, that's probably what I want. I probably need, like, to split the down arrow. It kind of looks like it could have been split when I first made it because of the shape it is. Maybe not. I don't know how it was made exactly. Is there a way? When did I split the down arrow originally? I don't even know why it came out like that in the end. I feel like... Okay, I feel like this isn't as crazy as I thought. So... I split the down arrow. Now I have two things moving down. And maybe it's like I just need to get them wedged right in the right spot. Huh, <laughs> that's funny, I like recombine them. Hmm, is that possible though? Get like this sort of train going, but I don't think that's what I want. Yeah, I don't want the down arrow in there. Huh. Oh wait, so that was almost good, but I need the two down arrows to move into place. So I want the down arrows synchronized. So I want that. Oh, okay, but then I need to like offset them the right way. Actually, I need them to start off offset. So, <laughs> this is tricky. This is like a weird. Okay, wait. Oh, so that was almost good, but I needed the down arrows. I need that set up with the down arrows. Okay, so. It's like hard to think about. Is it like this? But ah, but then I need then I need the down arrows to. Oh, I see. So I needed it to be like one of the down arrows is offset, so I can get into position. I mean, can I do it like? That, and then this, and then that, and then... Oh, it's squished. Oh. So that would have been good, but it's squished. Um, and that plus squishes anything. So only I and that one block are unsquishable. So that would have been good, but it's squished. But how could I prevent the squish? How to prevent the squish? <laughs> um... I don't think I can, right? Because it will wedge it no matter what. Hmm. Is there like a squish limit or something? Like maybe I could just... 
I don't think there is though, right? Like I can just keep squishing stuff together. Yeah, you can just keep squishing. Hmm. Cause I was hoping like maybe I could squish something to its limit and then <laughs> it would be forced to stay there. Uh, I don't know. I'm gonna come back to this another time. I did beat that area, so I'm pretty happy with that. What do I unlock because of that? Uh, I don't know, what did I unlock? I think it's like this thing, which is, oh, I see, so they're saying, if, oh, this is how I unlock the level. If I go into that, I unlock this one. If I put the eye into that, I unlock this one. If I put the spike into that, I unlock that one. If I get do that combination, I'd unlock that one. But we'll figure that out next time. Cool. Like this game. Thanks if you watched, and I'll see ya.